well, like everyone, is very insecure. And, uh, but it is at the same time an amazing drama. It's like a soap opera that goes on every day. It just keeps on running. I mean, I've been photographing Britain, and this is just another chapter. Uh, I understand that uh, Britain is really run by the establishment. You know, I went to places like Oxford University, uh, some of the major public schools. And Oxford University supplied most of the prime ministers from the UK. So it was very interesting to see the traditions and the rituals that they uh, hold. And therefore, I wanted to photograph that and make it another chapter in my ongoing collection of um, pictures of Britain. What was the establishment? What in the morning? Cambridge ones are allowed to go on until five o'clock. So I often advise people that are debating which university to go to, I would opt for Cambridge because the balls are better. Because of course, for me as a photographer, as the light comes up, that's when you have a great photographic opportunity. Uh, let's head now to the can British I, Abroad. Can I just oh yes, you can for them. Uh, one of the questions I've had repeatedly, as you know, is the heaviest voting uh, Brexit county. And Equally, I went to different things like this is the royal wedding, and if you see around the corner there, uh, there's a, uh, or if you go to that far wall, you'll see there's a St. George's Day parade. The biggest St. George's Day parade is in West Bromwich, and West Bromwich also is a heavily voting uh, Brexit area, so I went to the St. George's Day. Try and find out who we are, we look at ourselves, and this is a moment of self-reflection.